Welcome back to another DZ Collects video. We have a fun release day rip 2023. Bowman Chrome is out. If you like prospects, this is the product for you. Uh, I always love opening a box. I'm not the biggest into prospects. I, I'll admit I don't know a lot of the prospects, but it's a very fun rip. You get one autograph per mini box. There's two mini box in the Master Hobby box. So five cards per pack, six packs per box, so 12 total. We're looking for some first autos, hopefully. We're looking for some parallels. If we're super lucky, we're greedy, and we are rooting for a Babe Ruth Retrofractor, one of one. That is a $200,000 bounty on it, but that's unlikely. I would like to hit a Babe Ruth Retro card just because I think it's cool. Um, him and Roberto Clemente and Johnny Bench, I believe, have cards in this set. First Bowman cards, since they didn't have any when they came out. Uh, I'm going to pull up some of the refractors, just so we have a list in case we pull any. I'm excited. The boxes were on pre-sale originally through Tops were like $250 or something. My LCS had them for 309 today. I know blowout cards, they're like 350 the Price on my LCS will probably get adjusted as the day goes on, but that's what I got it for. Shout out to Cardiacs in Apex, North Carolina. Really cool card shop. I got a lot of my stuff through them. Really friendly, great people. We went with box number three. Because box number three is good luck usually. Pulls us some bangers. So we went with number three. We are going to hope box three gives us the Babe Ruth. We are going to get right into it. I know Ethan Solace is a big one. Yankees have some good prospects. If I don't know all of them, feel free to let me know in the comments if I miss some really good ones. Obviously, I'll do my research after I open these and I sort these, but... We're going to get right into it. First pack of 2023 Bowman Chrome. All right, we're just going to get right into it. I don't know what the parallels look like. So we have a Joey Votto. We have a Vinny Pasquantino rookie card. We have a first Bowman of Rainer Arias from the Giants. Vaguely recognize that name. We have a Jacob Reimer first Bowman. There's our Vinny P. And we have an Arizona League, Fall League, Jefferson Cuero from the Brewers. So that's the AFLS insert. I vaguely remember Jason Dominguez is in that, so that would be a sweet pull. I'm going to put that there. Try to sort these into piles. On to pack two. We have some shiny stuff here. We have a Christian Yelich. We have an iconic series of Riley Green. We might have our auto coming up. There was a thick card, I think, in there. So there's Jacob Berry. Gabriel Gonzalez. An iconic of Riley Green. Oh, nope, it's just a rookie card. Ezekiel Toa. That is numbered. Oh, refractors are numbered in the set. So that's what it is. A refractor of right or Ezekiel Tovar rookie. I'm hoping our parallels are prospects. I don't know how I feel about that in Bowman Chrome, but out of 499 Ezekiel Tovar, we have the iconic insert of Riley Green rookie. That's a cool looking card. I'd have to look up the odds. I don't know how prevalent these are, but very cool looking. I think the Iconic is one of the more common inserts, I believe. Scroll down for one second. All right. So we have Oswald Peraza rookie right there. We have a gold coming up, so we're going to hope for some big hits. That is what it is right there. We're just going to ignore that. Brady House, a Xavier Isaac, a first Bowman to 75, and that is an auto. First Bowman, Luke Berryhill, catcher first baseman for the Astros, and that is a gold auto to 75. 
So again, I don't know much about Luke Berryhill, but a Bowman first gold auto to 75. We will definitely take that. Luke Berryhill of the Strohs. Very cool card. Love that. So there we go. First mini box, we get a first Bowman gold auto. Not complaining. Joey Ortiz rookie. Bryce Miller rookie for the Mariners. That's a cool card. Hey, let's go. I love these inserts, and it's a Yankees prospect. I'm a Yankees fan. It came to the league. Spencer Jones. CFL 12. These look really cool. The card looks good. Centering's good. Actually, center is not the greatest top to bottom, unfortunately. But that's a sweet card for the PC. Spencer Jones. It came to the league. We have Yadair, I'm not, I don't know his name. And we have Yasser Mercedes for the Twins with a really bad print line going through it. It's the first one I've really seen that looks bad, so hopefully that's just an outlier. We have a Never Nervous Matt Mervis rookie card right there. A Matt Olson. We have another refractor coming up. So there's a Feline Celestin. That is one of the big prospects you want that is a celestin first bowman auto for the mariners we will get that sleeved up asap and we're going to put that on the stand because that is a good card we have a d'angelo sarmiento first bowman for the mets there's the matt olsen and we have a iconic Manny Machado. That's a throwback photo from when he was with the Orioles. Really cool photo. I like that. An iconic Manny Machado. That looks dope. Very cool looking insert. Like I said, probably a more common insert considering it's already the second one I pulled. But really cool looking. So last pack of mini box number one. Let's see what we can hit here. Hopefully we got some fire. Yo, Garcia, we have a gold shimmer. Let's go. Sorry, gold shimmer. We have Sebastian Walcott, first Bowman. That's a cool photo. Janara Miller. A Riley Green rookie. And a Drew Gilbert gold wave or gold shimmer to 75. So that is... Yeah, I don't says... I don't think this checklist is quite up to date with everything it should be. That should be a gold wave. That looks very cool. 275. That is a fire card. Drew Gilbert. So that looks really cool. We're going to put Tovar down for now and put the Gilbert up. So that is box one. We are going to box number two. Like I said, I don't know all the prospects. Hopefully we can hit an Ethan Solace in the second mini box. An auto would be even better. Brandon Maya for the Yankees. So let's see what we get. We got Miguel Maya for the Cubbies rookie. We have NC State legend Patrick Bailey. That's a cool card. I'm an NC State fan, so I love that. Christian Vaccaro. Jose De Paula for the Dodgers. A Patrick Bailey. And then a Heston Kerstad from the Arizona Fall League insert. That is the base one of those, but very cool looking card. We're going to sleeve up the Patrick Bailey rookie because I'm an NC State fan. And that is the first rookie in this year's products, I believe. He wasn't in any of the tops ones, so that is really cool for me personally. That will go in my PC. I'm sure he'll be an update series coming out at the end, but I don't know. We have a James Altman. We have a Cracked Ice or Atomic coming up. So James Altman, rookie. We have a Jordan Alvarez iconic from back in the day. That's a really cool card. We have Kevin Parada for the Mets. Samuel Munoz. There's the Jordan. And then the Cracked Ice Prospect Process, Alex... Ramirez and that is numbered to 150 prospect process Alex Ramirez that is a 
fire looking card. I don't know how rare this insert is, but that is gorgeous. And that is numbered to 150. We're gonna put that on the stand. That is gorgeous. The Jordan Alvarez, very cool as well. That is a very cool looking card. We're gonna set that down over here. Uh, prospect process is one in 12 packs. So about one per, you get one per box. So that's really cool. And uh, it comes in the atomic refractors. So there's three variations, atomic, orange, and super refractors. So only three parallels for that card. So that's really cool. We get, we have a green coming up. So there's a Miguel Cabrera. Green is to 99. So we got something to 99 coming up here. We got Alex Ramirez again. Gal Tamaris for the Rays. We have a Bo Naylor. And that's our auto. It is not a first, unfortunately. It is Joey Ortiz, 99, from the Baltimore Orioles. Again, I do not know a lot about him. I was hoping for a big name I knew, but hopefully that's a good prospect. I'm not 100% sure. You will have to let me know down in the comments. I'll just slide him over here. We have, what, three packs to go, including this one. All right, we have a Christopher Morrell rookie for the Chicago Cubs. Ronald Acuna Jr. We have another, it came to league, and it is another Yankee, Anthony Volpe. It came to the league. That is a fire card look at that that is gorgeous as a yankee fan i hit the two that i wanted from that came to the league set the spencer jones and the anthony volpe that is gorgeous i love these cards so much that goes down there we have an axel plaz rookie first bowman for the pirates and a juan benjamin first bowman for the guardians right there two packs to go See if we can get another numbered card in here somewhere or hit something rare. This appears to be base. So a iconic rookie, Francisco Alvarez. That's a sweet looking card. We have a Bowman Invicta of Ivan Melendez. So I'm not familiar. That is a thick card. So Bowman Invicta, Ivan Melendez. I know Invictus are not a guaranteed auto, or not guaranteed pull, so I will gladly take that. I don't know a whole lot about Ivan Melendez, but the Invicta, I don't know what the odds are for the Invicta. It does not say, Bowman Invicta is one, I don't know, it doesn't say. Bowman Invicta is one in 24 packs, so every two boxes, basically. So there you go, Bowman Invicta, Ivan Melendez, not a guaranteed hit. We gladly take that. We have a Gutierrez first Bowman for the Mets and Emmanuel Bonilla first Bowman for the Jays. We have one pack to go. We are hoping we can get an Ethan Solace. Let's see what we get. It doesn't look like we have any color coming in the last box. We do have a refractor, I believe. So there's a Freddie Freeman. Manny Machado. Jackson Churio. Marco Luciano. And our last card is a WBC DD Gregorius to refractor to 4.99. So DD Gregorius shortstop. WBC flag insert refractor to 499. So that is kind of cool. I don't know the odds for that exactly. Yeah, it doesn't really say yet. I'll have to look that up. That is very interesting. But very cool nonetheless. So so quick recap. Obviously, a ton of prospects, the DDWBC, the Ivan Melendez Invicta, Joey Ortiz, gold first, Luke Berryhill to 75. We have a gold wave. This is a really cool card. Prospect process, Alex Ramirez, Atomic, Spencer Jones. 
Let me know what you think. If you enjoyed the video, hit a thumbs up. Leave a comment down below. Let me know, are you buying any of this? If so, what prospects are you chasing? I'm gonna go ahead and sleeve all these up, go through and sort. Let me know what you think the best card was in this box. If I missed a top prospect that's really good that you think I should pull to the side, leave a comment and let me know. I might order one more box from Tops if it's cheaper. I only got one from my local LCS because I wanted to get this video up today. We also have a Bowman or a Tops Chrome Sapphire video coming either Thursday or Friday of this week. It is out being shipped. It is should be for delivery in a day or two, so I'm gonna get that up ASAP. Thank you so much for watching. It really does mean a lot to me. At the time of this video, I'm at 299 subs. Hopefully after I upload this, we will get over the magic number 300 and I will try to come up with a giveaway. Thank you all so much for watching. It really means a lot to me. I have a lot of fun doing this. I could not do it without your support. So thank you and until next time, take it easy.